Hey y'all. So my face, my swelling is going down a little bit. I just brought my oldest son to school. And now I'm about to get my husband and my other kids up. I think my husband's gonna take one more day off with me today. I think he's gonna take one more day off with me today. But as you can see, it's still a little swollen. Purple. This is me just doing some light cleaning before everyone gets up. So today I'll be cooking gumbo because I'm able to swallow the juice with a little bit of rice without having to chew. So I think I'm going to go ahead and cook that today. I went ahead and got my 8 year old up for school. Then I took some extra time to love on my husband this morning. It's all about being intentional with your love. This is me trying to drink some water because as you can see, my face is still swollen from the dental surgery that I had on yesterday. So I'm just trying to take in some water. Good morning. Good morning, Mama. Where's your cheese? I took some time to talk to my mommy this morning, then it was off to shopping. Okay, so these are the ingredients that I'm going to use for the gumbo. My kids like ve like it very simple, so I used air chill chicken organic. I used this roux from Savoie, and I used turkey sausage. Okay, so these are all the seasonings that I will be using today in the gumbo.
Okay, so I'm gonna cut up my sausage while my meat is currently browning. My kids do not like the gumbo with the onions, bell peppers, and all of that in it. So I have to make it the way that they like it in order for them to eat it. So no biggie, I just make it the simplest way possible. I brown my meat up, cut my sausage up, add my sausage to the pan, brown those up a little, and then I go in. And then after that, I'll go in with a gallon of water. I normally get crystal geyser, and I'll put the whole gallon of water in there. So after the water starts to boil, this is when you go in and you add your roux. You add as much as you need. If you like your water a little looser, you add less. If you like it a little thicker, you add a little more. My kids like it a little on the in-between side, so I have to add a good amount of roux. Now I understand everybody cooks their gumbo different, but this is the way my kids love to eat it and that's the way I'm gonna cook it. They love it, okay? The seasonings, everything, it was so amazing, guys.